Hello everybody, welcome back to another, to another try at Novgorod. I oh know, so blood. We failed this mission, we're not going to fail it this time. I feel like choosing the sheep would be for the, for the best. There's nothing, the extra crowns would be nice. But I think the extra production of the boat plan, the halberd, is a lot better than this. The sheep folds are very useful in regards to the fact that we don't get much food. And yeah, I think I think the extra food that the that the um, sheep folds give me makes this better. So first time Harvey we failed, had eluded us, so Egil left to track him down himself. He was to send for me upon finding him. In the meantime, Bran and Halvar insisted we establish a far-reaching supply network for all our future expeditions throughout Northgard. This would be a war of another kind entirely, one to be fought with gold rather than steel. I just had to focus on the task at hand, waiting to hear from Egil. Here we are, a certainly an excellent spot to establish a commercial choke point. Let us roll up our sleeves. To be honest, I'd rather not spill blood. It is bad for business. Good day, my lords. I see we have all come to the same conclusion. This region should be the commercial nerve centre for, for the visitors. Greetings. You must be Liver the Raven Clan. Lieutenant that scum Hagen. I'd rather be an ally than the enemy. But the Nord Norn seem to disagree. Do not expect mercy from me, Raven. Soon enough, all goods I do in Northgard will have to go through us. I mean, last time didn't happen. Indeed, there's only room for one trade tycoon, and I'm afraid I can't let, let you put a spoke in my wheel. Still, I wish you good luck. Refreshing to see that the battles can still be fought without childish chest whooping. We too bid you good fortune. You will need it. Better get started. The key to victory is build a long ship dock and lighthouse to make use of the great trade routes. Skalka. How much cuts is lunch? A housey house. Guess Skalka. I need to, I think I need to focus I need to focus more on, you know, getting getting the coons. It's actually nice that I found this one first, because this is going to be a good food area. And I need to find this one as well next, which is good. I like it. So I'm going to get my food supply up pretty quickly, the wood supply up pretty quickly. Which is nice. I think we can get this one pretty easy. Well, but it's nice if I've got my food supply up right away. Okay. Ooh, I don't have the material for that. 
But if you go still walk in the fields, that's gonna stiff. Oh, okay, so each farmer produces five, which is nice. Um Okay, start getting the raid going. Even if it is just one. It's better than none. Raid. Sure, give me give me law. Okay, scouts doing scouty stuff. We can do food. Nice to have got this one as well, but you know you can't always get what you want, right? Eh? Next a villain that pops out. Yep. Get up here. Build a woodcutter's lodge. It's needed woodcutters lodge there. I probably put at least one of them to start working up here. Both of them to start working up here when it's done. Yeah, we'll get three going on now. I tell you what, there's no point having woodcutter go and uh, go and do boat ready stuff. Give me more crowns. When can I build a lighthouse? I'm loath to have put this believers finished building a lighthouse. She's bound to launch major expeditions soon. This means building a lighthouse of her own should be our top priority. We can't afford to fall behind. You'd say that, and yet here we are. Yet here we are. I'm close. And by close, I mean I can do it right now. Oh, I can't because I need shipbuilding tech. My god, she's got so much luck so quickly. What? Okay. Sheepses, go. There's me with sheepses. You are there. So that's going to start bringing in more food from the sheepfold, which is nice. One villager, let's put you back into the woods. So the sheepfold passi passively brings in five, which is always good. Uh, I don't know that. I've got enough food now for that. Hunting cabin. Hunter's lodge. Go. Do also need a warrior camp. Not going to be fun. Do you need more law as well? I do need to go for that ship in one ASAP. So ship building. Get a rune stone. Get a uh, so get a rune master going. Or law master in fact. So farmers, hunters are really the only people that's going to give me food. I need to keep a area free so I can build another ship dock down here. And then hopefully build another ship dock down here as well. It's like, I think that's where I went wrong last time. I need to prioritise that to get a food silo. We could build the food silo. We'll just get more food out of these two buildings. I think that's how this works. Improves food production by specialised workers in this area. I'm going to assume 
sheep as specialised workers. I would call sheep specialised workers. You also need to train again, but I didn't get attacked much last time, so... I am loving the soundtrack. Yeah, we're building of a shipyard. We need a hundred to follow up in the first place. Okay. Um, this soundtrack just really makes me want to go and play uh, Banished. It really does. I just want to go play Banished. Okay, that's not good. I need to focus more on my buildings. Oopsie doopsie. So there's another building that I really need to build here. So I can put one house in here. Whilst this is important, Let's go focus on that first. We're bringing in more law, there's shipbuilding. There's a feast. I need to use feasts way more. I think that was one of the other things that was limiting me. In my other one. Build the line, I'll say so. Don't go do the thing. I'm gonna start need to get a military up soon, so. So I've still got three buildings there. Wait a minute. This didn't save over? Okay. Maybe I switched off or something. Okay. Losing crowns. No losing crowns. Military training camp. Build it up here. Merchant could build. And then once I built the training camp, I'll put him as a warrior, and then I'll go use him and help out to fight the wolves. Since I probably need two to take down the two, makes sense. I could probably solo the two of them, but I'd rather not. I need to go and get the spring up here as well. Those plus two happiness is really important. Through 16, I can get three more villages out of them. Okay. I don't have the croons. Cows hurts. Never a good thing. Go and get my food then. You two. Go kill wolves. Yeah, both the wolves are going to stop my hero. Find him a hero. Because it's winter. 
I need to turn off this stop route. I need to get some. Have to go for. Into 120 food might take a little bit. I'm getting incredibly close to 16, so let's build another house in here. Like a house in here. First one so far. It's been upgraded. That's not been upgraded, but not got the crowns for it. Well, winter's behind us and we have some stone in store. Now she's trying to upgrade as many buildings as possible. Good thinking. Expanding is more than just a luxury. It is key to victory. It has allowed us to affect more workers and make our activities more efficient. Yeah, like the one thing I've forgotten in this game, I like the way it's still working in the background, but it's paused by the fact that the bar's not going up, is where, like, Age of Mythology, which I played the most, it was just, like, even though there was a finite amount of resources on there, it was always just like no real limits to your expansion other than where it like specifically made it. Whereas this game is very different, it's very strategic. I need to like, change my mindset. We we'll probably won't be able to upgrade all our structures, though we should carefully determine which is the most important. And we should remember to keep mining iron as well. Our workers could use better tools. Yeah, so like in this game it's very much instead of just like oh, I can upgrade everything I want this and that and this and that it should be very much the fact that if you're upgrading that then are you sacrificing something else for upgrading that so I've still not got a healing cup. So you do see I should have really got a healing cup as well. And I get the wood of course. I just need more wood. The food's nice. I'm not going to ever complain about that. Getting more wood is... Raid. Get some, get some um, favors. Favors, fame. There you go. Travel axes. Want more wood. Right now, let's get more law. I didn't realize like more law meant more law. More law. Oh, thematic, thematic, magical. Okay. I don't know what I'm saying. Here's all. Thing I want over here is well, the marketplace might don't have. Ew, no. Scout died. That's the reason why I want the geyser, which is here, I think. Or there. I think it's there, maybe. Is in regards to the happiness of the next. Also, I want a new villager. Ready to, ready to work. Exactly how I like it. You, 
be a healer for the time being. There's people that need to be healed. Okay, we're actually making crowns now to get the home trade route going. They'll start climbing as quick as she is because she uses the same trade route. Right, as we've, as we've got a stone deposit. Under attack. Well, that was terrifying. I seem to be attacked from down here a lot. Let's just keep my units down here for the time being then. Okay, we've got a free villager. They work in the trading post. As much as I would love another person to go work in there, in the longship dock. Need to learn, need to learn coinage. Of course, I do. This point is how to if you work law then. Need more law. The special ones is always, is always nice. Draga tombs. Let's get, let's get. Fame! It's too free sheep. Get an additional sheep fold as well. Nice. I need to build a brewery. I'm actually fine for wood, so I'm going to take one of the woodcutters down here, make them turn into a villager again, and that would be nice to get. Um, I will get another full thing. Oh, nice it. And then because I've got some more sheep, then I can bring them down here. So, let's get first of all a forge. Forge, forge, forge. Well, I sell sheep for first, so. Keep forward. Forge. But more fame. Nice. I can't do anything else to expand commercial influence. More law. Um, 
I'm pretty sure that Liv is a good head start. We should work twice as hard to keep up from falling behind. Well, yeah, she has. What was I doing now? Oh, lord. Yes. Uh, I'm not got you yet. Very blessing right now. It's perfect. She's making food still, which is nice. Let's get the forge done. Let's improve the uh, farmers, hunters, fishermen's. It's only. Okay. We've got the two. Can I build a fisherman? Quest fish. Okay, no, I can't. I was like, can I just build a fisherman by the coast? But I actually need the. I actually need the resource of fish to be. In the in the area for me to be able to do that. And this is a really bad one. I lose fifty percent production. I need I need some of my non-captive sheep to go over here. This is losing me out on a lot of... Fans are happy. Oh, that's not good. I'm only in January and we've got no food. This is bad. Oh, you've stopped. Let's go here. Build the next one. Oh, we've got maximum buildings. And we can't upgrade it. Okay. Well, you'll be just working in the trade post right now. Go to be a hit village and then I need this actually to be built. How much better houses? I need crowns for that and you know I don't have crowns. The hunter's tools should give me more food. Should. Crowns, give me more crowns. I need to upgrade a house to make you happy. Yeah. A trade route ended. That's not good. Uh, and then I can destroy that building. Yes. Gain a lot of food so I can make nice feasts, colonize areas, so I'll I'm fine trading my wood. I've got plenty of decent woodcutters. Scout died. I sold a little bit of overcrowding problems.
do that. Uh, healers produce more food. I should have more, any more iron now after that, which is great. I should have paid, maybe put more fall behind it. Maybe. Uh, You come up here. Why am I telling you to go up there? Become a sailor first. A sailor? Scout. And then scout that building. You're halfway behind her now. She's 40 and 20. We need a mine. I can't have a mine. So I need another five crowns going. Let's change this to law. The extra, the extra tan little bit of law will be helpful. So over here, I want to build another longship dock. Build on fish things. And then, because I'm going to run out of housing, probably. Build another house down here. But I do need a short person to get that first. Whilst you're doing nothing, let's go and turn you into a, turn you into just a villager. Um, we'll be able to build stuff. Hopefully you'll be done, hopefully you'll find me the geezer, hopefully we'll be able to expand to the geezer because I need happiness. Okay. And then... Oh, wait, I, I put you into a woodcutter. There's a house, is that a house? house okay now, become. now build that wasn't good I think I should be fine from attacks this way so I can just bring my uh, army up there again should and really should. But we're unhappy again now. Scout, I need you to... Scout. Oh, so I needed... I needed a brewery like two days ago. Left the area there. Feast. Okay. That's really all the population I should kind of need. That's going to be more lore. Let's do the half, half stone. So, reduced extra wood consumption by 50% and food by 20% in winter. So, in fact, we wish we needed. needed. Did 
do need a healer back there. I am keeping a live though. And I have got the great trade route of 20. Maybe I should. As much as I need law right now, I kinda need you to be healing. And stop with yourself. Probably won't need any more population size. And 31, 31 is plenty. Okay. Okay, so this is the. There's. Oh, there's the guy, is it? Okay. So, Warband, go! Not you first. Got the food for it. Oh, nice. I need the happiness. Listen. Yeah, the kobolds get a little bit happier with me. I'm slowly catching up. I was 20% behind, now I'm 18% behind. So, kind of not catching up in kind of, you know, anywhere whatsoever. Yeah, that's not good. That's not good. What else is broken? That's broken. That's perfect. Gives 20% happiness. Now, so 20% to happiness and 10% wood consumption. A little bit of the wood consumption has gone down, uh, food consumption has gone down because of the sheep holds, not fully operational. And then the forge is really the last thing that's kind of needed. So whilst he's over here, he'll become a brewer as well, because I need that extra happiness. Nice to ex exercise that, explore that as well. Now we can get more lore. Food trade sounds great. So now, because we actually got a decent food trade thing going on, let's change trade route food with the kobold star trade route. Sixteen percent behind now. You become a brewer. You're fresh out of the gate. What do we need? Just helping ticking over with food, really, aren't you? Yeah, the food silo, that gives us more food in this area, increases the farmers by a little bit. Yeah, more food. Like, we've gone from five to seven, so every little helps. What else could you be good at? Okay, another, another What did I click on? What are you going to be doing? Did I click on the docks? Did we only have one person there? Alright. Okay, so we've now got six sailors? Six sailors. What else? Could we need it up here? We don't have a law person. Another law stone would be great. We can get another blessing. How does blessing right now? Seven people. Okay, we should be churning them out like nobody's business.
Am I catching quick enough? Mm. It doesn't feel like it. I'm getting more law, and more law can only be a good thing. Right, right, yep. I'm thinking that was only a good thing. Still some stone there. Let's upgrade the trade routes so we get more crowns. We've got a Yarl. One free feast per year. Okay, that's great. There's an iron mine there that I'd like. I'm under attack. Yeah. Why didn't we see this? Why didn't I see this? Uh, what do I need? What do I need? Liv is taking the lead. We need to hurry up and catch her. Something to that effect. I think I said that wrong. Um, hmm. I forgot what I was doing now. It really took me out of the moment. Uh. Okay, let's see if we can upgrade the sheepfold. No, we need more stone. Okay, that's maybe what I was doing because we've got two villagers. Okay, become a miner. Countdowns. Well, I guess what our extra person is going to be doing. Exploring. I'm going to explore the scale. Get more lore. The negotiation one. Perfect. We've got an extra sheep, so I can oh, We need ten stone, don't we? I kind of don't want to spend another 100 kroner. A kroner crowns on that. I'm sure we're going to get stone from there. I need to panic. Too much anyway. Yeah, I also need crowns to upgrade that. And also, they're going to want more better houses. I just need a lot of stone. It's just, that's just the crux of the situation. Look at these iron deposits over here. Hot. Darn. Wow. There's no ruins up here. I really should expand. Feast. And I should expand. We kill the droggers in this area. Let's go and expand in this direction real soon and give some of our scout to do. Maybe, maybe. Uh, doing scouty stuff. Maybe let's just do that. Turn it into a scout and then, okay. and then go explore this. Go as more good stuff. Explore. These iron mines are bonkers. Really just bonkers. If you first let's go to this dragon. That's like full Valkyrie. Okay, we're out of stone here, so. That you do. Another healer would be nice. Okay. I 
in the meantime, so I can upgrade that. Upgrade that. So now one villager can go work in there. And then I don't think I need two, so you can go and work in that dockyard. I can also work with that, get a few more resources back. Perfect. Yeah, still giving me the most money. 14. I they seem to be able to change over. I just need more stone. Yeah, maybe I need a second person in there. Uh. 760 for a feast? Wow. I may have feasted too much too soon. Oh my god, I'm so close. 67% versus 60. 7% banded. I'm 7% banded. I'm gonna do this. I'm counting my chickens before they've hatched. I'd love to upgrade that. Okay, amazing, perfect. I am at 31 of 31. Okay, so remember when I was saying when I don't think I'll need another, another house? Well, I'm gonna need another house. Hey, you want to do my good work here, sir? Yes. That's upgraded. That one's upgraded. This one can be upgraded. So, because I've got an extra bits of crowns, let's go buy more stone. Let's upgrade that dockyard and then... As soon as you finish building that house, then I'll put you into there. And then hopefully... Hopefully that'll be enough crowns for me to be able to upgrade. Oh my god, we're under attack. That's not good. No! Okay, that was terrible. My warrior died. Yeah, I need to wait for the last second and then go. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna go up to the next trade route thing. Losing three crowns. Yeah, that's uh, that's what I need to do. I've put another woodcut up there, so I don't fall behind in wood production. The farmers are working overtime down here. Get another person to forge. I did lose a person there. I think I lost a woodcutter. So let's go put some on the forge and then we can go miss some. In fact, I shouldn't take a person from this. I should take you because you'll be a lot worse. So it'd be a lot better if I take you off it. Sign there. I don't want to colonize whilst I've got this modifier though. Minus 10, uh, minus 11. Oh, I'm so close, 73%, 72. Oh, we're gonna do it. Means I can actually change this great trade route down to this one. I can actually get some crowns now and I don't have to focus so much on crown production. Is, you know, nice. Okay, so now he's now they're in there, going to upgrade some people.
Hey, I'm all about making people's jobs more efficient. Woodcutter, Belgium, Woodcutter. Ah, ships come back from the Great Trade Route. We're at 150. We're actually ahead. We're ahead. 1,526 versus 1,518. We've got the beautiful, beautiful trade route. Drop. Then I can upgrade one of those. How can I find my lost sheep? And there. They're in there. And that's producing an extra bit of food now. 16, so that one's probably producing 9, 7, 9, 7? No, that's. Why is it 16? That's got three sheep, though, right? Yeah. Oh, that's because it's got the upgrade of this silo. Yeah, so that's producing like 10, and this one's like 11, 5. Yeah, more like 11, 5 than anything. Pulling it out. I'm pulling. I've got a percentage. I've got a two percentage lead. Let's get more law. That little bit more extra food isn't really needed. Really needed right now. So I can just kind of, you know, sit here, wait. just kind of play I can play the long game because I'm going to win if I stay in good situation oh I found these giants how wonderful North God is full of surprises a of intimidating ones and that's the Anta are said to be formidable opponents they are peaceful but would take any intrusion as an aggressive action I strongly advise against antagonizing them if they agree to trade with us we could build a mutually beneficial relationship it's worth trying. We should establish a route from a trading post. Yeah, this is what I want to do. So seeing as I've got... I'm making way more than enough crowns now, so... Let's change from you to... Jotnar. Stop the trade route. So because the Cobalt like me, the Cobalt have got good relations. The woodcutters have been improved. Which is, you know, always oh, nice. And then because we've got nine sailors, might as well upgrade them. Yeah, powering ahead now. Powering ahead. In there's my law. I'll just take all of this iron for myself. And there's another runestone down here. Well. Mine, mine, oh mine, oh mine. You can just be here and just witness the amazingness of that mine. You know? I get a free feast this year, don't I? Get your blessing as well. More stone, more iron. I can upgrade buildings. Because this is in a very good place, let's upgrade it. The woodcutters do more woodcutting. You're just going to be bim. You're just going to be bored for now, but in a second. Two of you are going to be very, very busy. Rats have been reported to need healers protecting against disease. We're under attack as well. Um, instead of having merchant, I've got two healers. Great, that's to get more heals this then. So much I am. So, so much I am. I can just improve everyone's tools now. So, more masters. Let's do more. I've actually got two scouts. 
What do scouts do when there's nothing else to scout? And then we'll do more, and then we'll upgrade the merchants as well. Who is in there? Why not? We'll, we'll be able to upgrade everyone. We'll be able to upgrade everyone. And Yotnar still don't like me. Or maybe I, I can slow down, in fact. I can actually. Oh no, stop upgrade. I can change the great trade route back to being at home again. So I'm a hundred ahead, so I got six percent. So it shouldn't really matter too much. Hello, Marty Fresh. How you doing? Yes, I'm all good, thank you. I'm I'm perfectly fine. How are you doing? Uh. Got the two healers doing healy stuff, uh. but because we've got a rat infestation coming, I might as well. Rats would have our fifty percent of any food not not sold in the silos. So everything down here is gonna be gone. But stuff down here is gonna be fine. But we should get free. In fact I can actually put a I can't put a salad down here. Oops. I wonder if this will kill like five people. It probably will do, won't it? Three people. You're good, thanks. That's great to hear. It's great to hear. So, yeah, so what have you been up to whilst there's been a lockdown? Okay, the people are going to be happy because they want better houses, so. The houses that I'll build up here, I'll upgrade all three of these. So then I'll. Destroy one of these houses. There's the rats infestation. And everyone's unhappy. There's the rats infestation. We've got healers going into overtime, so let's go destroy the house. Yeah, destroy the house. And then this person that pops out of here. Won't actually pop out here because I'm unhappy. Oops. We have won this level, though, which is the best thing, though. Oh, I can upgrade it. And you come down here and build a food silo. Because I think this is the other place that I get major, most of my food from. I mean, the sheep folds over here as well. Yeah, I, could, I probably need to build a food silo down there as well. Yeah, the people are getting sick because the rats have infested, infested our food silos and. Sorry, have infested everything that's not stored in a food silo, so. I think this being a hunter's lodge produces food. This field produces food and so do the sheep fold. But there's, this, there's a food salad here to protect these two. There's not a salad here and there's not a salad here. So I think that's what's making people be sick. So that should hopefully be for the better now. Um, So I didn't explore as much as I did, or expand as much. In fact, I probably did, because I probably, I think I took that and that and this in my other playthrough, and I lost. So I think I stayed a little bit more compact. I reached out and got the iron, but and got so much iron that everyone in my village can be upgraded. Come on. 
Oh. Medicine's gonna be nice. Is people still unhappy? No, people are not unhappy. Healers did the job, all three of them. Unfortunately, I didn't manage to make the Jotnar happy one, so... I wanted a giant. But I did win. And you know what you say? It's all about the winning. Only 18 left to go. We're 99%. You may have beaten beaten us. You may have beaten us last time, Liv. But we won this time. We've won this time. Hello, BTV. How you doing? Seven, six, five, four. I can hear you come down. Three. Two. One. Yeah! We win! Our trade supremacy over the region is now established. Any resource that goes through this estuary will have to go through us. Suck it, Liv! Congratulations, my lords. I have been bested fair and square. I suspect my master will not take this kindly. However, so do you enjoy this hegemony of yours whilst it lasts. Well, this region has outlived its usefulness to me. I bid you farewell. I am less than eager to hear Haldra's reaction to this. No doubt I am in for an earful. He's going to be so annoyed. He's going to like smash stuff up. I'm doing good, thank you. I'm doing good, thank you, BTV. I hope you're doing I hope you're doing good as well. What an uncanny reaction. She had fought with fairness and resolve, and yet her praise seemed sincere. Hmm. Maybe she just, you know, liked the battle. Grand, Helvet, I just heard from McGill. He's tried Hagen down to a region nearby, and so I should join him now. I would ask for you to fortify what we built here. I'm glad your revenge is at last within your reach. Be safe, my lord. We'll join you as soon as we can. Do keep in mind, all of our future exp uh, operations can connect to this region by establishing a trade po a trade route from a trade post. Ah, so that'll be like the home thing. So everything will be back here. Perfect. Yay, we did it. Chapter 4, trade